It's always inspiring to see allotmenteers use their plots to grow a range of plants that can stretch from food across to beauty and health. And in the end, it is all about the same thing, that of, of growing plants that nourish you and make you look and feel better. Well, plants that nourish me and which I now grow with avid fervour are chilies. I love them. Don't harvest them too soon. You can see this one has still got touches of green on it, and that means that the flavour hasn't fully developed. And if you love chilies, it's not just for the heat, it's for that fruity flavour. But once they are ripe and reach their full colour, like these long red slims here, it's important to pick them as soon as they're ready, because a ripe chilli will inhibit the ripening of unripe ones that are growing above. So, if I take this and just cut it off, like that, and I think this one is ripe too, so I cut there. As that one is perfect. This is a beauty here. So this is now my first chilli harvest of this summer, and I will eat these fresh. Now this is elephant garlic, and I harvested this at the end of June. It spent the last month in the greenhouse drying. And you can see that the stems now are completely dry, there's not a trace of green on them, and the roots have dried off, and yet the bulbs are still full of vitality and juice. They haven't dried out at all. So now they can be prepared for storing. But over the years, we found that they keep beautifully if you just clean them up and put them in a basket. If they're in a cool, dark place, they will store easily for six months and very often for up to a year. And when you clean them up, what you need to do is, first of all, cut off the stems, like that, and then take off the roots. And what you're left with is a head of garlic, which is enormous, and each individual clove of elephant garlic is as big as an average head of normal garlic. And although it's so big, it's much milder. But for everyday use, this is fantastic. So we cut that off, trim off the roots, and away we go. And I'll just work my way through the bath. 